traveled many a bumpy road in the darkest of nights, serving as a chauffeur to beings of sweet starlight. I migrate with them like a shepherd, roaming with my flock of winged midwives as a fellow follower of the bloom, a self-proclaimed nectar nomad. I was introduced to this artistic science of beekeeping two decades ago as a U.S. Peace Corps volunteer collaborating with peasant farmers in South America. The bees captivated my curious mind and working in an outdoor office made of fresh air, flowers, and freedom enticed my soul. My nomadic journey as an apiculturist has taken me far from where I could ever have imagined, having come from a humble home in Pueblo Indian country in New Mexico. My heritage is a mosaic of cellular memories influenced by my Native American ancestors who instilled in me a profound reverence for place and purpose, and to pursue acts of community service. So I chose to become a bee farmer, as I wanted to continue to learn from Mother Nature and Father Time. As a farmer, I share beekeepers' voices of concern and need for adaptation and innovation to fulfill our dedication for local to global food production. Sharing their challenges, I became encouraged to return to academia to help quantify their observations and advocate for pollinator conservation. Now as a researcher, my quest to better understand the relationship between cultures, food systems, and stewardship is at the forefront of my thoughts. Honeybees are like some of us and our ancestors, immigrants to this country. They have adapted and become the backbone of agriculture. There are distinct ecotypes or subspecies of honeybees like races and humans. And these ecotypes carry genetic histories like seas which contain their very existence and memories of creation. For within each one, they have the power to nurture and adapt and the magnificence to create life, food, and medicine for the world. One of the things I most enjoy about beekeeping is that it bridges cultures and goes beyond borders. It connects us to our origins as fellow beings of light, as a part of this land, not separate from it. This magnificence is alluring and inspires me to find and connect with bees and their keepers around the globe. I invite you all to accompany me on my Nectar Nomad storytelling journey as I chase the bloom, encounter cultures, and follow the liquid starlight known as honey from flora to flavor to feast. Vuela chimbilada